Hello everyone. Hope you're okay. I just want to quickly show you. Um, it's Thursday today, but you are not going to see this probably till next week. Um, so as you would have probably have seen, I have been uh, slowly doing a bit of cleaning every day. So I just want to show you by doing these simple things, how easy, it, you know, and simple, easy and tidy my house is. So I'm going to be showing you all upstairs. Yeah, granted, I've just done Harrison's room. Um, but I'm just going to show you the other two rooms because just by me making my son pick up his toys, by me making the beds daily, um, it just makes me want to do, makes me want to keep the house tidy. Um, so I'm going to quickly show you my room, Ruben's room, whole landing and stairs into Harrison's room. Um, so obviously I, well like I say obviously, I live in a old house. It was built in 1911. I absolutely love my home. Um, and it's taken us years and years and years to decorate as we want it. So stepping off my landing where I was just videoing. So this is my bedroom. Still exactly the same. I've been able to maintain. Yeah, my bed is not crisp. You know, it's not um, hotel. I've got a hotel vibe going on. It's a huge bed. And... I haven't nailed the making the bed, but give me credit, people. I've actually made the bed. And it's something that I've done nearly every day um in January and February. So but I wanted to start doing because we just we were just never daily bed makers and I don't know why. So this is the room and I'll just give you a quick So yeah, it's it's probably a little bit muddled now. Things are not in the colour order. But I've been able to maintain it because if it takes you less than a minute to do, you have to do it right away. And I'm not sure what YouTuber said that, but it's something that I always have in my head. If it takes you less than a minute, then you do it right away. And it is a great, it's a great thing to keep thinking. But you never guess what. Yeah, you never guess what. Since I've sorted all my wardrobe out, you know. Since I made it all look lovely, sorted it, decluttered it, reorganised it, guess what? I gotta go back in the office on Monday. Full no, not no, I don't work full time. I gotta go back in the office now, full time. Cause flipping Drakeford, he 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 only just lifted the restrictions and you know you don't have to work for mom anymore. So I'm like I've just I knew I said I know I said that it's easy. All I gotta do is just get them and move them there. It's a simple job. But <sighs> mean them out, I mean them out. So I've got to, you know, next week now for three days I've got to actually wear proper clothes. I can't just can't just be in my lounge room in my pajamas. I gotta, I gotta be at my desk. But yeah, so I've managed to keep my wardrobe nice and tidy. This one, um, that's a present that I've wrapped early, um, and I'll just be giving that next Thursday. I, I've held up my end of the bargain. Yeah, I've done mine. Marcus, hmm, little, little bit untidy, but doesn't matter. Uh, so yeah, still all my cupboards. I actually need to find a new candle because mine, um, I've, I've used mine now. So yeah, so I'm going to show you. Let's shut the doors. So yeah, simple, quick and easy. You would have seen me do this. Oh, there's my squash. Let's have a little drink. I don't know when this has been uploaded, but that is my landing. Um, my landing, probably once upon a time, it was like an airing cupboard, but my dad made me the, made these beautiful cupboards. And what I need is doors. I reckon if I have doors, that would just look so much better. Like the ones in there, I want doors. I don't know if it'd be two very slim doors or just be one gigantic door. And you just open it 
like that. Um, can you imagine what I could hide in there? So now we're going off out of my room, landing into Robin's room. Look at it. So his room is all lovely. So he, in the mornings, he does play. You know, we are up early enough, like half seven. And he will have, a, you know, a few games of Paw Patrol. But he knows. So I make his bed. Yes, it's not the met, it's not the tidiest of bed making. But look, I've made the bed. So this is his room. All nice and tidy. So now we're going to be going into my hall landing and stairs. Um, you may have seen that but there, I want some nice Ikea shelves. Um, we usually put that lamp on in the night. None of us are afraid of the dark. But I personally would like a mirror there. I don't know then, oh see there's the stairs. I don't know how we're gonna get over there. I want you to see it. I don't know how we're gonna get over there to hang something. So I don't know how other people manage and like in these big houses. But I would like some this colour's natural hair, see, and I don't know if you can see it. So yeah. But I would like something on the walls up there. Um just to bounce the light. So I think yeah. Oh my room looks blue in there, but it's not it's, it's um sage green. So if I could have a mirror on there, that would bounce that light, so it'd look bigger. There's the attic, there's my lights. And then over here then, we're going into Harrison's room, with a light above me. And then again, I would like something, if I go like this. There's the bathroom door. So then I would like something, but you, maybe not like a long mirror, but something. Let me know if any of you got any ideas. I don't think like I don't think maybe a shelf would suit there because it'd just be straight in your way, wouldn't it? So now we're in Harrison's room. I have just cleaned this, so it's not much different. It's all nice and tidy. Let's turn off the lights on because it's like flipping blackpool in you. Um yeah, so let's have a little look. This is the light we have on in the night, and it's just really cute. But I do want to jazz it up a bit. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Yeah, so that's just an update of me keeping my house tidy. Um, I didn't do anything on Tuesday. And it's okay to take a day off. We literally, well, Marcus did take a day off. Um, all we did was watch telly. Um... He was in and out of consciousness, sleeping. I just had a... What did I watch? Oh, I was watching Twilight. I'd watched number one, and then I watched number two and number three. Um, I watched number two and number three. In the day, the kids were in school. I literally dropped them off. I did a quick um, food job to our littles. Come on. Chuck my pyjamas straight over my clothes and watch Twilight 2 and 3. And I just, oh, I just forgot how amazing. Oh, you can't see me now. Yeah, I just forgot how incredible films they are. Like, I read the books. Um, but I didn't keep the books. I kept my Harry Potter books. But I didn't keep them books. I don't know why. Um... I, I would like to read them again. Um, but yeah, I watched the films. And it was one part where they were on the mountain and Jacob had to carry her um, so that the vampires didn't smell her scent. They only sm smelled the scent of the wolf. And then they were on the top of the mountain and it, like, it snowed overnight and Edward was there. And I was like, in what world are we picking Team Vampire? We're always Team Wolf. I was like, our people Team Edward always be Team Jacob. Because you know what I'm like, I don't like to be cold. And I was like, if I was in that, if I was in that situation, I would want Jacob. I, well, I'd want Jacob in any situation. And um, 
podcast and we were watching it and I because I was like going like who would you pick who would you pick and he'd be like I picked Team Jacob but I was watching it and I was wrapped up in a blanket and I was, and it was making me cold because like it does when I watch a film that is like cold or it's like icy or snowing it literally just like Whoa. well I'm talking about it now it makes me cold and yeah so I was watching I was watching that but I don't know, I've completely gone off the conversation but yeah don't worry I have a day off um if you don't feel like it um in my case, it didn't mount to anything, you know. We weren't like, oh, look at the state of the house. It was just, I wasn't as productive. But it doesn't matter because then I got out of bed at half past two. Um, and then I had a little bit more energy in the evening. You know, if if you have days off, some people some people uh, can, can be completely different. They might... Um, they might work nights and then, you know, the only bit of time that you have is, um, you know, just before you go to sleep or just before you're woken up. Everyone's different, you know, it's easy for me. I, you know, I have four days off in the week so I can keep on top of things. But yeah, don't, don't let it get you. But I hope you've enjoyed my little tour. So yeah, please let me know. Um, so as I was saying... Just comment below and let me know what on earth I can do with the decorating now. Because I've obviously I've done all the painting. It's just making it look more homely now. Um, and all the interior part of it. So uh, I just don't know. I, I've seen the shelves as I want. I've got them downstairs. So I just need them to be put up. Don't know what we're going to do. I don't think a full mirror would look good in that space by Harrison's door because then as soon as you walk out the bathroom door you're always going to you're always going to be looking at yourself so it's always going to be like a long mirror so that could frighten some people so I don't know maybe some nice pictures some nice artwork um I don't know let me just let me know but definitely I want a mirror on one side and I want somebody with really really long arms and a a drill to put some pictures up on the other side. I don't know how people manage to do it. Um, so yeah. So I'm going to love you and leave you everyone. So take care. Stay safe. And stay warm. Bye.